out there, my name is Mrs. Toyin Samemehelu. Hello. So I'd like to just share something briefly with you in this video. So a few months back, guess what happened? Hmm, you want to know what happened? Ha, ha, you love gist. <laughs> My husband actually called me and told me about an edtech company. And I was wondering, oh, really, edtech company? He said, well, Toy, guess what? You've been in the education industry for close to 30 years. So why, I think it would be a very nice idea to get to talk to this organization. And I said, okay, well, no problem. We got talking and then I was shown a particular content for secondary school students. I mean, JS123 and SS123. And the content was, guess what? Animated video based on the Nigeria curriculum. I was fascinated for several reasons. One, this video was really enlightening, engaging, enriching, and it was so much fun. I don't want to talk so much. Get to look at what it looks like from the scoop. Let's learn about how the body keeps the conditions of its internal environment constant. Most enzymes are proteins and they function optimally within a small temperature range, about 36.5 to 37 degrees Celsius. If the internal body temperature rises abnormally, say to a value significantly higher than 37 degrees Celsius, Enzymes may be denatured, and they will be unable to catalyze life-sustaining biochemical reactions within the body. Commerce, we've said in a previous lesson, involves all the activities that are involved in the buying and selling process. And all the activities at every stage become a source of livelihood for someone. Now, who remembers all the divisions of commerce? I'll help you out. They are trade and the aids to trade. Transport, tourism, communication, advertising, warehousing, insurance, and banking. So why don't we look at one occupation from each division of commerce? In transport, there are numerous modes of transport. Road, rail, air, and sea. And this means there are lots of occupations in that industry. John plays golf. The verb or verb phrase is plays, which is a main verb which shows a habitual action. Z has become a lawyer. The verb phrase is has become. It indicates a state of being. Has is a primary auxiliary verb and become is the main verb. The king might reward Daki. The verb phrase is might reward. Might is a modal auxiliary verb. And reward is the main verb. Now in the sentence, Mr. Sam should have deleted the file from his computer. The verb phrase is should have deleted. Should is a modal auxiliary verb. Have is a primary auxiliary verb. And deleted is the main verb. Let's consider some other examples. Now in this sentence, they do love games. Do love is the verb phrase. Do is a primary auxiliary verb, and love is the main verb. The essence of do in this sentence is just for emphasis because the sentence is the same thing as they love games. All right, so I guess you've seen it now. I would like to let you know about the U lesson app for children. You can see love when written right on it. I mean, when I bought, I had to get a pack for my children who are age 10 and of course age 7. They are yet to get to secondary school, right? But guess what? They were able to learn so much. And I was like, hey, why will I keep quiet and not share this awesome, awesome learning software with the whole world? And that is why I'm doing this video for you. So if you like to get this pack for your children, for your friend, French children or perhaps you are a teacher in a secondary school or you are a school owner, administrator or a school leader. Just click the link anywhere around this video or send me a direct message to learn how to go about it. I will be ready and more than ready to answer any question you have about it. Thank you so much for watching and bye for now.